What we're looking at now are my first two prototypes of a device to put more than one digital camera on the same type tripod. The reason I want to do this is because I only have one nice tripod, but it does take a lot of space. But it's nice and heavy, it's made of aluminum, it's not plastic or anything like that. And I got nice small digital cameras, and usually when I use more than one of these digital cameras at the same time, it's for uh, the same purpose, pointing in the same direction. Like I want to get low magnification and high magnification pictures of the same object or something like that. So. I have multiple cameras obviously and often I do want to use them at the same time. For example, this one shoots HD video. This is the one recording me now. This one does much better low light performance. This one does a built in time lapse mode. So I wanted to use them all at the same time on the same tripod just for convenience reasons. So I came up with this idea of just taking a piece of wood and then putting these bolts on it. Now I originally, this is my first prototype here. I actually made it too close together. I thought this would fit, but I had to... But that was assuming that I could actually easily turn these bolts. What happened was, I got these bolts locked in place so they're not loose, but then I actually have to spin the cameras to put them on, so they're too close together. Now this is nice thick um, wood. It's nice and sturdy. And as you can see, I put in four bolts. I was hoping to fit four cameras, but they just don't fit on that way. I screwed up my spacing. Also, I had a hole in the middle that was going to be for the to put on the tripod here. That actually didn't work very well because it was too hard to get a good threading in the wood for this. So I wanted to put a bolt here, but it was too late. With this big hole here, I couldn't glue on a bolt very well. So the second prototype is here. I didn't make a hole in the middle. Instead, I used a whole bunch of super glue to put the nut here. That's what I meant, nut. So the tripod is screwed into a nut that's super glued onto the wood. Now this one's kind of flimsy. This wood is kind of flimsy. I don't like it. Obviously it's handling three compact digital cameras just fine, but I do have an SLR and I really doubt this thing would handle the weight of the SLR. So um, what I did was I screw, put these on. These, these bolts, they, they don't rotate. I've got them tightened down. So I, put the, I spin around the camera to put it on the bolt. There's a certain amount. You want to be careful not to go too far. You'll break the camera. Then I tightened the bolt. Well, then I rotated the bolt so that all the um, cameras are facing the same direction, which would be away from me, obviously. Then I used the nut on top to keep the bolt from spinning. So this will hopefully keep all the cameras pointed in the same direction. Now, besides the obvious benefit that I can put all, or I'll be able to put four cameras on a tripod if I ever get a, another I might get a GoPro Hero camera, but also be able to take it off the tripod, hold it by hand like this. So if I ever want to get a, you know, multiple perspective shot of a steam train going by, I'll be able to pan along with the steam train or something like that. So each of these prototypes took less than $4 in parts, but due to my lack of tools, it actually took like over an hour of labor. But if you have a better toolbox than I do, it would probably take you five minutes. That is all.